Hello YouTube, FSP here. Nighttime video. Uh, so uh, busy week this week. We got vacation Bible school and stuff. At week uh, this week, I'll be busy at church most of the time. Uh, will not be any videos on the Silver Channel this week. Uh, so my uh, knife I told you I ordered came in, and we also did. Uh, we went and uh, bought groceries today, so I'll have a little prep haul to show you here afterwards. Let's get this thing done first here. Let's see how this stupid box opens. Hope y'all are having a good day and a good week. I wish you all the best. These boxes with these tabs sometimes are confusing. Just gonna muscle my way into this bad boy. I reckon. This is the uh, Kershaw knife that I ordered. Six blade, watch for that. There's the knife box. There's the paperwork. More of that, okay. So this is the Kershaw, I know it's gonna be backwards on your screen, but the Kershaw knife I ordered. Let's take a look at this booger. I'll give you my initial impressions on it. We'll do a review on it or something later. After I've used it. I doubt I have a chance this week to really try it out. But uh, we will look at it. See if it comes good and sharp or not. All those important things. Well, this is a kind of a small fixed blade knife. Comes this is uh this is not kind of this is plastic, which I, I knew already. So uh kind of a small I think it's about a four inch blade, small fixed blade, uh got a fairly good amount of thickness on it. That's that's not bad. Uh, so uh, got this uh, you can you can wear it this way you can put your belt loop through it there you go and uh, or you can do scout carry do it that way run you some uh, some string through and tie it around your belt sideways this will go in the uh, it'll go in either that way or it'll go in this way either way so either way you want to slide it in there it will go uh, let's check the edge. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Why is there scratches all over it? Pretty sharp. Not bad for a factory edge. Won't shave. Well, it'll shave a little bit, but it not not real easily. But uh, very, very sharp. Very, very cool. All right, I'm gonna wear that this week. Moving on, what we picked up at uh, Wally World today, prepping, prepping wise. Uh, I got this big waterproof box. This was like uh, 16 bucks. Uh, I don't know what this orange thing is supposed to be. I guess you put stuff in there and it's like a net. It holds it to the to the back side. I got this big waterproof box right here. Pretty cool. If I need to stash some stuff or whatever. It's nice. Uh, it's got a hanger on it too so you can hang it up. So pretty cool. Thought I would use that. Uh, surely I got some stuff I can put in there and make a cache or something. Oh, uh, we picked up some uh, allergy medication because God knows I need some more of that. Uh, the hammock I had out in the yard uh, for the last four years finally gave way on me. I pulled it out in the spring, I laid in it, and I hit the ground. So I got me another cheap 
uh, just an outdoor hammock. This is a two-person size. I like them big so I can lay in there and have all kind of room. So this was 30 bucks. They're cheap Chinese made hammocks, but for lounging in the yard, you know, it's fine. I would carry something better if I was going to put it in my pack or something to that effect. So we did get us another cheap hammock to hang out in in the yard. Some more paracord. I've got a big, it's a big male, U.S. mail bin. I'm trying to fill up full of cordage. Uh... I've been staying up late at night. Uh, I haven't been sleeping good, so I've been going out into the shed and organizing some things out there. And uh, I had two little ice cream pails full of uh, cordage, and I've combined all them into one big U.S. mail thing. And I'm trying to fill it up now, so. Can't get enough of these. Safety pins. These are the bigger ones. This was $4. Uh, 150 of the big they're called blasting pins but they're big safety pins and uh, I like the big safety pins you can use these to repair things they're awesome a uh, couple other things in that section I didn't know uh, I didn't know these things existed but they're made to thread needles with you use them to thread needles so I got me a little two pack of that it was like 89 cents uh, what else we get? I picked up another, you know, dollar. Uh, this is this first survival kit I'm working on. Picked up one of those. That's about it. Uh, I had ordered six hundred dollars with four winter parts a while ago, so uh, didn't spend much at Walmart because I knew I couldn't spend a whole lot. Uh, this was thirty bucks, and this big box was sixteen. That was. That was the bulk of my extra play money, I guess you call it. So that's what we got. Here's the new knife. Uh, definitely looking forward to wearing this and uh, using it as an EDC fixed blade. And, uh, you know, if I need to use it for survival, I can. And uh, pretty sharp. Not a bad factory edge. Uh, better than some I've seen. So better than some I've dealt with. So that's our video for today. Uh, Y'all have a good one. This is a FSP. Probably be the only video. Uh, I will do a live tomorrow on Tuesday. Also, my dad goes in for an arteriogram on Tuesday. And be, he could possibly be getting some stents put in. So y'all remember him and your prayers. If you would, I do appreciate it. It's FSP. Busy week. We'll check, check y'all later. I dropped the phone, Dale. Oh.